Hi everyone, today we are going to making a wari roll that is mixed beans. But what I do first is I pick the beans and yes, I pick it the Nigerian way, blowing out all the bad stuff, picking out any stones that I see and doing all this. I'll be showing you my day in the life video very soon, so keep watching. For the beans, we will be using about two cups of beans, one medium onion, maggi, which is like billion cubes, some pepper, I'm using pepper flakes. I'm also going to be using some palm oil and also sweet corn. Now, I have a pressure cooker and that is what I'm going to be using to cook my beans in. To start off, I am cutting some onion. I'm going to blend this onion, but you can just cut it into small pieces. You don't have to blend it. But my husband doesn't like saying onion in his food, so I have to blend it into liquid form. beans is also known as honey beans and you can also use black eyed peas to have this recipe so after rinsing it you want to put it into the pressure cooker then you want to add some water enough to cover the beans followed by the onion mixture after that you add your maggi and your salt and I'm adding about one teaspoon of each the salt to taste of course after that you want to mix it really well so that everything is mixed and it's now time to cook the beans you're going to be covering the beans with your pressure cooker i prefer using pressure cooker because it is a fast method of cooking and you just have to cook it for about 20 to 25 minutes and that is it for the first time cooking these beans so after you've cooked the beans, this is what it looks like. At this point, you want to make sure you test the beans to see if it is too hard. If it is too hard, cook it for another 10 minutes. Now after you've tested it and everything looks good, it is time to add in your palm oil. I'm going to be adding in about two um, spoonful of palm oil. You don't have to add in so much if you don't want it to be um, kind of reddish in color, but I like my palm oil, <laughs> so I add about two spoonfuls of that. After the palm oil has been added, you mix it really well to blend well with the beans. And next, you take your corn, and your corn has been rinsed. This is sweet corn, giving it even a sweeter taste. This beans is originally sweet. Some people will put sugar. I don't put sugar in mine, but um, if you do put sugar, that is okay. But it's sweet enough for me. So they mix it really well and next you're going to be adding some more spices so the spice that i'm going to add in i'm going to add in some pepper flakes and the pepper flakes makes it really spicy if you don't like spicy food you might not want to add as much as i did and just cook it for another 10 minutes so this is the final result some other things that i do is i also add in a tablespoon of crayfish dried crayfish which gives it another wonderful taste so if you want to you can add it in when you add in the corn so thank you so much for watching please do watch these other videos of ours and we'll see you guys in the next video thanks for watching bye